Paula Abdul wants caught Keanu Reeves going full Bill and Ted and playing an air guitar in his underwear. Abdul had to admit that the actor had pulled a full Bill and Ted on her when she went to introduce herself. How did Abdul and Keanu accidentally meet? What makes Keanu a genuinely good person? Stay tuned to find out all the important unanswered questions we need to be answered. Next up, how did Abdul and Keanu accidentally meet? Keanu Reeves may be better known today for roles in movies like the upcoming John Wick Chapter 4, but those early career roles have recently experienced a comeback. He is best known for his roles as Ted in the Bill and Ted movies. Every time you picture Ted or his jovial companion Bill, you can picture them playing some air guitar, which is something Reeves also enjoys in his free time, while Abdul at least claims as much. In a Watch What Happens Live segment, a viewer of Andy Cohen's show famously inquired about Paula Abdul and Reeves' relationship status. In the early 1990s, after both Abdul and Keanu Reeves had achieved fame, the actor for his role in Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure and the singer for her hit single Straight Up, the two co starred in the music video for her song Rush Rush. When Abdul went to introduce herself, he pulled a full Bill and Ted on her, though when asked if they had dated, she had to admit the answer was no. But she did get a good story out of their time together as she noted, I wish. I mean, I got to see him by accident. It was like the funniest thing. I wanted to introduce myself to him. I hadn't met him yet, and I went up to his trailer and the door was slightly open. He had headphones on, and he was air guitaring in his underwear, and I said, that's my boyfriend. Next up, did Abdul ever date Keanu Reeves? Keanu Reeves is now known as the internet's boyfriend, but in 1991, he played Paula Abdul's fictitious love interest in the aforementioned Rush Rush video while fighting off pressure to adopt the Chuck Spadina name. Abdul and Reeves are transformed into the protagonist of James Dean's well-known film Rebel Without a Cause for the music video itself. At one point, the actor even imitates the famous James Dean scene where he holds milk to his face in a gif. Paula Abdul was one of many women who enjoyed working with the actor in real life, but who did not date him while they were filming a new version of the famous story. In fact, Sandra Bullock, who plays with Keanu Reeves in the movie Speed, has previously addressed the issue of why she chose not to date the actor when it was brought up with her co-stars. The Rush Rush music video was released in 1991 the same year that the actor and his friend Alex Winter reprised their respective roles as Ted and Bill in the sequel Bill and Ted's Bogus Journey. Paula Abdul made this remark years later. This means that it actually makes perfect sense for Keanu Reeves to be going through a stage where he might be hanging out and honing his air guitar skills. He has likely been acting in a similar manner more recently as well. Next up, was Abdul's and Reeves' music video a hit? Here is a quick pop quiz for you. Paula Abdul released the ballad Rush Rush in 1991. The song, which is from her album Spellbound, was released by Virgin Records and went on to have tremendous success in the U.S. and become a worldwide smash hit. Rush Rush reached the top spot on the American Billboard Hot 100 during the summer of 1991 and peaked at number 6 on the UK singles chart. The song had a music video to go along with it that frequently appeared on MTV and other music programs and was perfectly suited to the song's mood. The video was notable for featuring Paula Abdul, along with actor Keanu Reeves. In the video, both Abdul and Reeves appeared to be acting out scenes from a movie, interspersed with shots of the singer belting out the song. There was no actual movie footage in the Rush Rush music video by Paula Abdul from 1991. Despite the fact that the music video features Keanu Reeves and seems to incorporate scenes from a 1990s movie with both Reeves and Abdul, this is not actually the case. Rush Rush's music video was created to appear as though it were a movie trailer. The scenes weren't taken from a movie that was released that year. They were created specifically for the music video. Next up, what was Keanu Reeves' role in John Wick? No one who has watched John Wick or Matrix can deny that Keanu Reeves has an incredible physique. His John Wick role requires a lot from him and his trainer, Patrick Murphy, makes sure that Reeves is in top condition to endure whatever is thrown at him. Reeves achieved a great body with jiu-jitsu, judo, and his trainer's effective program. Keanu Reeves worked out for four months before shooting for John Wick. John Wick features fight sequences that require higher amounts of training, stability, and mobility. Keanu worked out dedicatedly in martial arts, judo, and jiu-jitsu for his highly challenging role for John Wick Chapter 4, set to release in 2021.
2023. He has also trained himself in gun fu and sambo for the same. No doubt his workout routine is quite hectic, especially what he is doing for the John Wick series. John Wick needs crazy endurance, a powerful core and grip strength, Murphy defined. I spent a lot of time dreaming up different combinations and pairings of exercises. Reeves on the other side cooperated with his trainer and burnt the midnight oil to picturize every scene. Keanu is an animal, Murphy shared, applauding his performance during the most difficult training sessions. According to Men's Journal, Murphy programmed huge circuits with a large volume of reps and minimal rest. And the workout provided a variety of exercises that had a focus on Reeves' working out his shoulders because of the types of stunts he has to perform. Next up, what makes Keanu Reeves a great person? Okay, we all love Keanu Reeves for his chiseled good looks and the iconic roles he's played, from Matrix hero Neo to legendary assassin John Wick and the titular Ted of Bill and Ted's many bogus adventures. But in addition to being an accomplished actor, the 57-year-old screen legend is also a really, really good person. His random acts of kindness include secretly donating large sums of money to children's hospitals. Keanu's appeal lies in his chill, humble personality and the kindness and openness he shows towards his fans. His youthful looks have even prompted the creation of a webpage dedicated to his obvious immortality. When people ask him about his fresh looks, he says that he takes a low-sodium and low-fat diet, especially before his big fight sequences. I believe the secret behind his young looks is that he is modest, simple, and has a calm personality. He is respectful towards his colleagues and that gives him eternal peace. He stated, I was raised to treat people exactly how I would like to be treated by others. It's called respect. Despite being extremely tragic, Keanu Reeves' story can still serve as a great inspiration for many people. His experience demonstrates that, despite how successful they may appear to be, you never truly know what someone is going through on the inside. It also demonstrates the importance of never giving up in the face of tragedy. Maintain your forward momentum and your story may serve as an inspiration to others. Next up, how did he train for the Matrix? Reeves practiced Kung Fu and other martial arts for the Matrix's unforgettable fight scenes. I did a lot of training and it was really fun, Reeves answered regarding the launch of Matrix. On another occasion, Reeves exclaimed with pride that 90% of the action is done by Reeves himself. Reeves brought his stunt doubles with him from the Matrix to work on John Wick. They are probably back for revivals, too. Hats off to you, Keanu. I want to share spectacular news with you about the resilience of Keanu Reeves. Director Lana Wachowski had Reeves jump off a 46-story building at least 19 times, maybe more. He described it as awesome. Kung Fu Magazine states that Reeves went through months of mixed martial arts training to ensure that they had the essential action skills to shoot the movie's fight scenes. In an interview with Muscle & Fitness, Patrick Murphy expressed, Keanu's body was put through the ringer. This meant focusing on a high-volume, low-impact routine with limited rest. In other words, the injury was avoided by focusing on performing a high number of repetitions rather than lifting heavy weights. None of us is getting out of here alive, so please stop treating yourself like an afterthought. Eat delicious food, walk in the sunshine, jump in the ocean, say the truth that you're carrying in your heart like a hidden treasure. Be silly, be kind, be weird. There's no time for anything else. Keanu Reeves expressed candidly, revealing many secrets. The air guitar has definitely continued in Keanu Reeves' life in more recent years, thanks to the green light and subsequent release of Bill and Ted Face the Music. Do you aspire to be like Keanu Reeves one day? How would you react if you accidentally saw someone playing guitar naked? Make sure to let us know your thoughts down below. Thanks for watching.